What's up, y'all? What's going on? It's Corner Sports Net. Go ahead and subscribe, like, share, and comment. Now, everybody's talking about the post-race interview with Shakiri Richardson. Now, her first post-race interview, when she just got smoked on the track, she was out of control. She was wilding, saying crazy stuff like, I got the sixth fastest time ever, like that's some kind of accomplishment. But then later on, she's relaxed. She gets her bearings. And take a listen. But before y'all listen, Shelly Ann didn't have to do she carry like this. She straight up laughing at her. She thinks the whole thing's hilarious. She's probably saying why she gets so much love and publicity when she finished last. She's just an internet celebrity. She's probably saying that right now. Just look at her, look at Shelly Ann's face. Yeah, you too, Sharika Jackson. I see you smiling and laughing. Now listen to Shakari. She's a whole different person when she's relaxed and calmed down. Just to be back doing what it is that I have a passion for, that's in my heart, that navigates me through day to day, was a blessing. Just to be back on the track, um, not coming in with expectations, but of course wanting to do what it is that I'm well known to do, and that's be a performer. But God has a plan for everything. And I'm a warrior, and I would like to say, um, after the race, I was in the heat of passion, <laughs> and um, I apologize for my language, but I'm a warrior. My passion will always come out for, for my love, for, for what it is that I put my blood, sweat, tears, and sacrifice into. This last month was a journey for me, <laughs> and, but that's no excuse, because at the end of the day, I'm an athlete, and today was the day. But it's not every day. It's not the end of the world. And like I say, if you choose to count me out, joke's on you. <laughs> oh, even after the race, even before the race, feeling the love thing, the genuinity was amazing. Knowing the fact that people actually care. Like, people actually see what it is that I want to bring to the sport, what I put out there, and it's a blessing for it to be recognized. And so I think for, I'm thankful for the support, and I will continue to be thankful for the support. And when I go back on the train and go back into competing, my support system, uh, down to the fans, my family, my coach, y'all all are in there. I represent you guys. So, like I said, don't take today as as an L for us because we're not going nowhere. <laughs> See now, when she carries, she's relaxed and calm. She's good. And she shows love to all the Jamaican sprinters, everybody. She loves all the sprinters. It's just that when she's competing and at the race, she's hyped up. She uh, She's emotionally charged. So she say crazy stuff. Yeah, she'll get better. She'll get better in the future. She'll mature. Like I said, the Jamaican sprinters, they're all around 30 years old. It wasn't great overnight. Look, I'm going to talk to these guys later. It's Corner Sports Net.